So what we're going to do today is uh, I've got a hive that was in an old pepper tree limb and uh, some resident cut it down and I went and put some cardboard on each end of it, stuck it in the truck and came home with it. So now I'm going to try and get that hive out of that log and into a regular box hive. So we'll see what happens. So we'll start out by smoking them. I'm going to smoke right here where their entrance is. And then I'll also throw some smoke in these, these open parts where the resident actually cut the limb off the tree. And so I closed it up. I basically just stapled some, some uh, cardboard onto the holes when I uh, picked up the log from the resident. And so we're going to let them steep in that smoke for a little bit. Okay, so what I'm going to start with is I'm going to set their, their new hive next to them. I made a stand and I keep an open bottom stand so that mites can fall, fall through. I use a screened bottom board for the same reason. In the front of the bottom board, I block off the underneath. In the back, I do just the reverse. I leave it open. That way I can slide a sticky board underneath whenever I need to. So we'll put the bottom board on top there. We'll put their new home right on top of the bottom board. I'm gonna go get a top, put it on there, and that's where we're gonna put them next. We're going to take a look inside now. There they are. And we're going to smoke them real good. And I'm just looking to see how the kind of general landscape of their comb, it looks like it's laid, laying kind of vertically in rows like this, longitudinally along with the lay of this limb. So I'll start cutting away one of the sides. I'm not sure, maybe this side over here since I started there. These guys are just sucking honey off the side right now because they're upset. All right, I'm gonna take this knot off. That'll be their entrance. And I'm gonna, so I'm gonna remove this chunk and then I'm gonna take that chunk off. What I'm going to try and do is remove comb and vacuum bees simultaneously. Judging from the activity, I think I've got some robbing going on right now with this open comb. So I want to get this comb into a box fairly rapidly. So uh, I'm going to start vacuuming up bees and removing comb. And I'll um, put that comb into uh, frames and put the frames into their new box. Now this takes a while, because the vacuum is at a very low speed, so it doesn't hurt the bees. But this is a good sized hive. We've got some drone comb on there right now. So this was a perfectly functioning hive. And what I'll do is set it into these frames and rubber band them into place as I go and drop them in. So that's gonna make them even happen. Actually, everybody's being really well behaved, all things considered.
long piece of comb here. Alright, so what I'm going to do is put this frame inside. As you can see, it's loaded with comb, almost all honey. So you can see maybe, I don't know if you can see in there, but I vacuumed up a ton of bees. Uh, hopefully, most of them belong to that hive. There was so much robbing going on, it was hard to tell for sure. So what I do next is unscrew the bottom and dump this directly into the hive. bunch in and then I'm going to open up this vacuum and I'm going to dump this bunch in. It's my hope there's a queen there. And we're gonna move them in there a little bit. I should have probably removed a frame or two before I dumped them. That's it, we're gonna leave. And we're gonna let everybody settle down. 